In today's episode, I share the books that I'm currently reading. Welcome to episode 177 of the Honest Entrepreneur Show, where I help creatives like you to master your marketing. My name's Tom Ross, and let's get into it. This question is from Maria. What books are you currently reading or podcasts are you listening to about marketing? Hey, Maria. My answer may surprise you here because I feel like a lot of people, and I've seen there's a whole lot on Instagram right now, it's like they are just consuming every book they can lay their hand on. There's entire book lists. There's people where they're like, I read a book a day and they're disseminating down that value and distributing it. I really, really don't do that. Um, I generally don't have the time and also I prefer original ideas so to be perfectly frank I feel like it limits my creativity and maybe that's very narrow-minded and very ignorant of me Um, there have been certain books that have really helped me but I feel the majority I kind of read it and it's like it just takes me a bit off my own path and I don't necessarily love that so there's been like the number of books I can count on one hand where they've fundamentally changed my career, but there's been a lot more books that I've read and I'm like, eh, it's not really for me. So um, as I say, maybe that's closed-minded. Same thing with podcasts. I just don't have the time. It's like, I'm running my company. I have my entire personal brand and side hustle here. I've got very limited time for my fiance and my friends and my family. So at what point am I going to be like listening to podcasts on repeat? And yeah, it, I, I just have a very small number because of that. So the podcasts I listen to are Diary of a CEO. And I probably only listen to that because it's incredibly sporadic when he releases them. So when he does, I'm kind of jump on it and it really gives me clarity. I did listen to Gary V's, but there's so much content. Again, I just can't seem to find the time to listen to it. I listen to the James Smith PT podcast, um, more on, on the kind of fitness side. But I like his mindset when it comes to business um, and that kind of thing. Books, I am halfway through This Is Marketing. I've been reading that forever. I recently on vacation when I had some time read uh, Building a Story Brand, and that was actually quite a good one. That helped me kind of rethink and reframe how I think about our value proposition as a company and our story. And I just bought a book, actually. This is rare for me. I'm gonna go get this because I don't wanna mess up the name. Okay, so yeah, I just bought this book. It is Super Fans by Pat Flynn. The verdict's out. I haven't even started reading it yet, but it's on my desk right now. It's next up. This is a perfect example of like the kind of book that I'm into because I'm not good at just consuming as many books as I can across a diverse number of subjects. I'm not Bill Gates. I don't have a tote bag full of books, but this really jumped out at me because this is literally my whole ethos in a nutshell. It's all about true fans, over followers and vanity metrics and things of that nature. So I think I'm going to love it. I'm familiar with Pat Flynn. Uh, fun fact, I actually had him on a, a podcast attempt. I never even released this podcast. I recorded a few episodes and, and never put it out to the world years ago. Um, but yeah, I think he's a wise guy. I enjoy his content. This seems very closely aligned with my values. So I'll let you know what it's like when I've read it. But that is my honest answer. Question of the day. What book are you reading right now? And would I enjoy it, do you think? Let me know in the comments. Well, hey there. You seem like the kind of savvy human being that enjoys high quality YouTube content just like this one. And if you'd like to see more of it, I hope you will hit the subscribe button below this video. If you'd enjoy more content like this, you can check it out right here. Make the right decision.